Alright guys, we're building a chicken coop. And these are from a, uh, where, a warehouse. These are crates. Yeah. But they break down into these beautiful little folding pieces. But I planned on using it for raised beds. But here in Florida they would rot so fast being filled with soil, I decided to make chicken coops out of them instead. I wish I had got more, but they'll just stack right together. Little mommy, Mrs. Turkey, you're being too loud. They're trying to film here. Hello. Don't mind the loud turkeys. <laughs> but we're setting these up for them for winter. Because during the summer, most of the time, we have roosts in, in the corners. corners. Just like what we have for the turkeys. They would sit out there and they would just go in here. To lay their stand. eggs. Yeah, and to lay their eggs. Which it was a little crowded for them. We're getting more chickens. So... We're making an additional bedroom. There, there we go. go. These bad boys just stack right together. And it's like an instant chicken house. Are you going to build a little ramp? We don't need a ramp for that little jump. What about the bantam? The bantam is getting there with no problem. Where is she? Oh, there she is. She's hiding. She, even though she's welcome to go out and forage, unfortunately, the guinea killed her mate, so she's um, a little under the weather right now. I don't we'll know if it was a guinea or... I think, it was, I think it was the guinea. See, everybody else agrees. <laughs> Yep, see? They're telling on the guinea. You say guinea. But see? They're ratting him out. I think Better be careful. Snitches get stitches. I think Stupid <laughs> is the only one that likes the guinea. <laughs> and so this is going to stop right there like that. So that's his top? Yeah. Well, should we get the, um... The uh, um, roosting post and the nesting box put in before we put the lid on? Yeah, I'm just going to show people what I'm going to do here. This is such a cool idea, guys. I'm so happy. My chickens are going to get more room. <laughs> Alright, so now what you doing? Now, I'm setting up the roost. We're just using dolls that we bought a while back. These were in the uh, old dog house. In the old dog house, yeah. They're all protesting you. <laughs> protesting you. <laughs> so. <laughs> Are we going to put one further down below or no? No. Okay. Uh, here comes the troublemaker. Guinea, what are you doing? Causing trouble. Causing trouble. Let's go. There we go. Pretty cool. 
You're doing good, honey. What's your name? So now I gotta get a board to go across the front. Well, don't we have to put on the other one? Yeah. And then we put it. We put the board on that, right? Yep. That one. Yeah. There we go. Not too shabby. No, this is awesome. You're digging through one of the uh, piles? Yeah. Or one of the whole cans? bag of O-rings, different O-rings. Oh, nice. We definitely could use those. Especially when we got to hang feeders. I don't think you had any shorter screws in this one. Well, that's just one. Yeah, that's just what? one of them. This is just one can of how many cans? <laughs> I don't know, that steel cam might come in handy for uh, Jim and Jess over at Green Dream Project. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they could use it for uh, <laughs> their dirt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we don't have electricity out in this area. Hence the reason why we're making the extra winter houses. And that's also why we don't have the brooder, the outside brooder over here yet. Yeah, it's too heavy for us to lift. We didn't realize uh, 12 foot pallets can be that heavy. <laughs> oh, here comes the troublemaker. Guinea, what are you doing? What are you doing? You're a troublemaker, you know that? Look at that house! All right, now, That'll be great for winter time. Yeah. And I'm going to put a board across this. Yeah. So it raises it up. Okay. And, and lets the air flow because one thing you do not want is your chicken coop to be too airtight. Alright, now we're putting the uh, vet board in. <laughs> Just to give it a little... Yes, and a slope too, so that way the water will run off too when it does rain. Your screwdriver's over here, honey. Cool beans, it's almost done. Oh, it's looking so good. All right. So what hinges are you using? The hinges your dad gave me. My daddy gave you hinges. <laughs> he cleaned out his garage with all his miscellaneous parts and gifted to me. And I think they like that we reuse, repurpose yeah. everything. And his stuff mm -hmm. is already coming in handy. Coming in handy. <laughs> the chicken coop, so it ain't got to be perfect. No. Oh, that would be perfect because with the south facing, you know, this is facing south for the winter time. But, yeah, the sun will come in, warm that up. Oh, it's going to be perfect. And you're just enjoying those carpenterians, aren't you? All right, here we go. There's the inside. And we're going to make a little ramp. <laughs> is that the under protest look? <laughs> All right, it is done. Everybody seems to be checking it out. Walk around. That's Rocky.
What are you doing, Giddy? You got your way, you got your way. And they're going right in. Are they? Yeah. It's the ramp. It, it's just something about a ramp, you know? But the ramp looks good. I think they're just checking it out. I got, I can see a black sex link in there. Oh, and uh, Rhode Island's in there. Yep, looks good, honey. And just so you can see, there's the ventilation. All right, guys, box number two is done. Same setup as the other one. Backside. The a little bit. Um, got the vent. And open it up. Ooh. This one has a nesting box and the roost on the side. This is going to be for Rocky and his uh, four girls. And they all seem to like to... Uh, nest in the in one area so i'm hoping that that they'll take to the uh, nesting box pretty good so but that's it all right so far we have what two more to go yep. and they're going to be built just a little bit different hey guys if you like that video hit that like button remember that bell and subscribe and if you want to see any of the other videos check out everything over here